Hi and welcome to Beautiful Within. So today I'll be talking about my kajals, my favorite kajals, which are these. This is how I store them in a big shot glass. So I will be sharing, I guess, my four or five favorite kajals with you. I will try and include the colored kajals also, which I like. So let's get started. First one that I have is the one that I started using when I started using a kajal, which is Lakme Iconic. This is the basic black one. Uh, now, as you all know, like we all must have used it. This has good longevity. Uh, six hours is what uh, it promises. And uh, it, it gives that. So I'll, I'll give you a small swatch of it. This is how it is. Decently black and decently pigmented. Uh, 6 hours is what, uh, it promises 12 hours but not 12 hours, 6 hours is what is good for uh, this kajal. But it is definitely worth investing in because it's a very good basic kajal and in daily wear, if you like wearing kajal, like I like wearing kajal uh, on a daily basis, this is really really good and because it's dermatologically tested, this is really really good on the eye, nothing bad will happen to your eyes. The second one is Maybelline Colossal Kajal. Uh, this is very similar to Lakme Iconic. I do not understand any difference which is there. It's a little bit darker than Lakme Iconic as you would see, just a small swatch. But so this is this is the Maybelline Colossal, this is Lakme Iconic. A little darker than it, tart bit darker, but not too much dark as well. And uh, price is also comparable. I would say both these kajals are very, very comparable. Uh, very, very easy to wear. Uh, de uh, definitely daily wear, of course and uh, i have invested in both of them even you can so this is my second favorite third is a favorite if you want uh, you know a, a dark smoky kohal kind of uh, eyes or you want smoky eyes this works really really well this is the himalaya kajal by the way and uh, this is i guess the darkest of all you can see this is the darkest of all as well and it is very very good on the eye because it contains camphor but somehow uh, even uh, uh, after its natural formula it is not very very uh, you know a smudging kind of a kajal it is uh, extremely smudge proof at least for two to three hours i can safely say so whenever you know i'm getting dressed up for a party and i need a thick kohal line I mostly use the Himalaya Kajal and it's not very expensive as well and very soothing for the eyes so definitely uh, a go-to investment. Fourth is the Plum Kajal. Uh, now this is uh, my second uh, like uh, what shall I say pen of the Kajal. I've, I've used up the first pen uh, so I won't be swatching it because I've not used it on the eye which is why I should not be swatching anything. Please be very, very careful with your eye products if you're swatching it, if you're showing it to someone, sharing it with someone, it can get difficult. So this is how the tip is. It is uh, the darkest of all. Actually, I should give you a small swatch. You can see, not not the darkest because like it, it has four blacks now, but it, it is really, really long lasting, first of all, very, very smooth on the eyes. So much smoother than Lakme and Maybelline and of course from Himalaya as well very smooth on the eye uh, gives a very very good texture so whatever like it, it it is a very good precision kind of a kajal so whatever shape or design you want this uh, really helps you get that and it's very very smudge proof i guess all uh, of, among all the kajal this is the most smudge proof of all so yeah these are my four kajals now i'll come back to the colored kajals first one that i have is the maybelline eye studio uh, liner in uh, the shade lilac give you a small swatch also though it's almost over it's not a very very pigmented uh, swatch like it's not a very very pigmented liner but it gives a very nice hint of color very very smooth on the eye and uh, thankfully like with kajals i'm very very uh, skeptical that they should not hurt my eye in any way like uh, no uh, infection or something of that sort and it is very very good that way as well color also as you can see is pretty pigmented for a lilac color the second one I'm already holding, you've got a sneak peek, is the Samba Green Essence Kajal Pencil. I'll sh give you a swatch also of it. Very cute dark green kind of a shade. I've not given a very dark swatch, but very cute dark green uh, shade. A forest, forest green kind of a shade. And uh, with Essence, the, uh, the, uh, the uh, good thing is their longevity. So the, uh, I have uh, had my Essence Pencil uh, lingering for around 6 hours which is very good for uh, colored pencils by the way because they fade off very very easily with Maybelline also it fades off pretty easily the third thing that I have is the Kajal by Teens in Intenso Kajal in Azure Blue so I'll show you uh, the swatch this is the smoothest Kajal that I have ever had like uh, 
colored or black this is the smoothest kohal that i have and you can see the pigment really really worth investing in so these were my favorite kajals uh, and i guess these are the best kajals available in the market or so i feel they are my favorites do let me know what are your favorite kajals as well and how you like the video if you liked it please do give it a thumbs up like comment and subscribe and thank you very much for watching have a nice day bye